a final break in the September scorcher means Columbus City Schools will resume classes tomorrow. The state's largest school district closed today because of the heat, but announced earlier this evening that students will have a full regular day of classes on Thursday. Meantime, the first couple of days of high school sports practices have arrived in the summer, summer sizzling heat wave. Tonight, schools all across central Ohio taking extra precautions when it comes to playing in the extremely hot weather. NBC 4's Tyler Carter live in Gahanna tonight, where that school district has specific guidelines when they practice in the heat, Tyler. Good evening, Mike. Yes. Athletic trainers decide on different factors when it comes on whether to hold practice outside. Are the players going to be properly hydrated with water and also looking at the temperature reading of the conditions outside? 75 right now really does not affect practice at all. Um, yesterday it got up to 87. Mike Townsend, the head athletic trainer at Gahanna Lincoln High School, says his team uses the Corey Stringer Institute guidelines when it comes to measuring the heat conditions outside. And based on what our recording says for the wet bulb uh, globe temperature, we have specific accommodations that we'll do. Um, which includes more water breaks, longer water breaks, um, and then some equipment removal. Taking in many risk factors like temperature, humidity, wind speed, and heat radiation. A reading under 82 degrees, players can practice at a normal activity level. But if a reading rises above 92 degrees, outdoor practice must be canceled. These are guidelines the Ohio High School Athletic Association recommends all sports teams must play by. If the heat and humidity combined get to a certain level, then we encourage uh, outdoor activity to stop. In the state's athletic guideline book, humidity is addressed when it comes to outdoor play and what teams should do to make sure player safety comes first. We really encourage coaches to take extra breaks during practice, make sure water is available the whole time, and in some cases, if it's really high humidity to go with a high temperature, it's best to stay inside. And practice just wrapped up here at Gahanna Lincoln High School. Yesterday's wet bulb reading was 87, so the players had to wear helmets, shoulder pads, and shorts. OS a OHSAA says that it's up to the high school to whether they're going to cancel practice or even cancel a game, but these are all just recommendations that they have. Live and local for you in Gahanna, Tyler Carter, NBC4.